restrung it and uh, went through the action, made sure it played nicely, and it does play very nicely. But this is not our rebuilding work, it's just our refinishing work. So um, it was just a consignment. Bosendorfer, that there was a nice piano, but now it's an extraordinary piano with regards to appearance and the functionality is nice. It's not been tuned yet. We'll get it a tuning right before it goes out. All right. Okay. So here it is with the lid put on. It's just not completely on. We got to finish putting the hinge on. And uh, but here's the piano. Beautiful finish. It's hard to see everything on the legs there. You can't see the two tone very well in this lighting. But you can see the two tone in the lid. Yeah, I've got pictures of the legs too. This is just for the video. All right, here is your piano. I have the pedal liar on it at the moment. Now notice it's really out of tune, but the action is nice and smooth. since it's been refinished but but it really does tune up nicely the pin blocks tight <laughs> okay so that's the piano um, it'll be uh, ready to ship your way as soon as Paul gets here with the truck Paul is coming out of the Northeast right now I expect him back here we're yet at least three days out, probably three to five days realistically before he gets here. Um, pending no delays. And uh, once he gets here, I'll pick it up and head on through Denver to California. Inside, I'm going to open it. I can't open it too far right now, but there's a shot of underneath. Oh, and the fall board. You know, we did this in the wood tone. Um, took a lot of work to actually get that wood to match because it's actually a different wood than what we have down here on the trim but we had to bleach the wood to make it match the color because it was much darker naturally. Um, the original Bosendorfer logo is there, it's all brass. It looks just like it used to and here we left the black on the top so you get the black cover. It gave a nice consistency to the piano. We, we debated whether to go wood with the key cover but I like the way it, it bands all the way around in black rather than the, the offset of the wood tones there. You can see the shop. <laughs> you hiding from the camera, Rachel. Yes. Right, here's another video for Theron Wagner. Uh-oh. What's all this sitting on your piano, Theron? <laughs> well, just know we don't have enough tables in this space, so we got way too much going on. So this is kind of what happens in between coats. Still gotta be lots of coats of sanding and whatnot. But the real world of piano restoration. It's a hard, hard world here. We stay busy non-stop, day and night. <laughs> In this cozy little shop. The big heater to go when it gets real cold out. And we got the other big shop heater up there. And this is nice also if you got to do work outside to get the big torpedo going. See all the pretty legs we've got here for pianos yet to be restored. Many, many of them. These are some pianos yet to be restored in line. If you got a piano you want restored, just give us a call. We'll put it in line. <laughs> now these, most of these are ones that I own that are going to be restored in my time. Um, that's our most recent restoration job, that one will be done shortly.